Blanche, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you it's doing? It's time to change the date, okay? <laughs> Is that your really? song? Is that your music? <laughs> Is that your jam? You know, no, it's not my jam. It's the guy who crushed away. It was, I wouldn't listen to something like that. <laughs> Today is the Let's 16th. see. I want to show you changing the day. Okay, go. Right Today there. Today is the 16th. Okay. Now it's official. It's getting closer to Christmas. Okay. So I got. You want to answer some questions from the YouTubers or? From YouTubers? Yeah. Well, of course. Hello. Do you want it? Of course. Okay. I have a little, I have a little, so oh, I gotta okay. work, on, work on my throat later on. Do you want to? Because I okay. don't want to turn like what, what happened to you. I, I don't oh. want it to get bad. You got to <laughs> nip it in the bud first, kind of man, okay? You got to nip it, okay? Okay. So you, are you up to it, though? You want to answer some questions? I, I'm up to it. Of course, I'm up to Hi, you two people. Are you sure? Let me say hi to oh, you okay. two people. Yeah. Hi, you two people. Hi. I want to answer you some questions. You ready? Excuse me if I have a little, you know, <clears throat> okay, but... Uh, Yes, okay. I would well, let's get right to it. Questions for YouTube people. Let's nice get right people. to it. Let's get right to it. Okay, go. Okay, um, Kitty Razor. Kitty Razor says, My birthday is on the 19th. Can, plan can Blanche please wish me a happy birthday and promise never to blow that horn again? <laughs> My dog didn't like it when she did it. Plus, it is not nice. It is kind of hard to stay positive when you have a horn blowing in your face. Yeah, what's up with the horn in the face? What's up with that? Well, uh, <laughs> let me wish Kitty Razor. Is that her name? Yeah. Kitty Razor. Wow. Oh, Birthday on the nineteenth. Pretty tough name. All right, Kitty Razor uh, on December nineteenth. Uh, happy birthday, Kitty Razor. Uh, I hope you have a real nice uh, birthday, and that uh, you have uh, prosperity and and and, and happiness and a peace of mind, spirit, mind, body, heart, and soul. Uh, and uh, and uh, and uh, that you have a great whole year, not just on your birthday, but the whole year. Uh, uh, in fact, for forever. I pray that you have uh, uh, tranquility in your life, and I uh, and also uh, you know don't worry about what other people think about you. Some people might think, oh, you shouldn't be saying this or you shouldn't be doing that. You know, uh, but, but uh, don't worry about what they think about you. It's more important, Kitty Razor, what you think about yourself. Cause that's you gotta live with yourself. So you, you think about, you know, your your own self, and don't worry about there be too many people saying what you should be doing or what you shouldn't be doing, and be confusing to you. So you know, so always do the best you can. And thank you for your for your question, Kitty Razor. Oh, I'm not done answering her. What else? What about you the horn on? that you're always honking in my face? <laughs> oh, um, it says yeah. Promise, like it? promise never to blow that horn again. My dog didn't like it. It's hard to stay positive when you have a horn blowing in your face. Well, Kitty Razor, I, I, I can't promise that of, of, of not uh, blowing, blowing a horn because... Um, Why not? Well, because uh, she... And I, I'm sorry your dog doesn't like it either, by the way. I'm sorry. But uh, um, the, the horn, to me, it represents happiness. Like, I have good news to tell the YouTube people, Hong Kong. <laughs> Or I have to oh, yeah, so, ha so much happiness. So much happiness. Honk, honk. <laughs> like, for instance... Yeah. If somebody honked, knock on your door, Kitty Razor, and honked the horn in your face and said, you just won $10 million, would that be positive or negative? Well, that would be positive. So it all depends on how you look at things. I look at it as positive, like good news, honk, honk. But, uh, you, you know, uh, thank, you for your, thank you for your question. I, okay, I'm going to go on to That was a good the... question, in fact. All right, that was Kitty Razor. Thank you, Kitty Razor. Okay, um, Jennifer Hinton. Love you, Blanche. Can I get a birthday shout out for my grandson Hayden Murillo and I? My birthday is December 19th and Hayden's is December 23rd. So a birthday shout out for Jennifer Hinton and Hayden Murillo. Jennifer and Hayden. That's her grandson? Yeah. Jennifer and Hayden, uh, I, yeah. um, <laughs> I, I want to wish you both a, a very happy uh, um, birthday birthday wish. I, I, I I, I'm positive that you, both of you, will have uh, great times together, and that you both are healthy and strong, and have peace of mind and spirit, mind, body, heart, and soul, uh, and, and that you you have uh, prosperity all year, uh, and that and that uh, you, you know, as, as you as you uh, get to know each other better and better, that uh, your your love to, your, your love grows and grows and grows until it's a. Uh, throughout the universes and everywhere 
and the universe is yeah oh, okay. their love is so far it's out, oh, yeah, out yeah. of sight out of the universe so uh, happy birthday to, to uh, with Hayden who Jennifer Hinton and Hayden Marilla Jennifer and uh, Hayden yeah yeah I wish you a very a very happy birthday okay um, this is Taylor Taylor can Blanche wish my daughter Aubrey a happy birthday she's turning one Oh, she's turning one? Yeah. Her, her Aubrey, daughter? yeah. Oh, okay. And what's the girl's name? Taylor? Taylor Taylor, Taylor is asking Taylor? you. Yeah. Uh, is I, asking you to wish Aubrey a happy birthday. I, yeah, uh, Aubrey. Yeah. Aubrey, I, 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 my, my, my uh, wish for you, Aubrey, is uh, to, to be strong and healthy uh, and, uh, and, and grow in wisdom and knowledge and guidance and, and always get direction. Uh, uh, in your life so that you could be a, a better person and that uh, you always have happiness and prosperity and you use your, you use your, your your wisdom for good and that that way you could help others as well as yourself and your family and, and the little child grow up strong and healthy and beautiful and uh, and and, uh, and giving and, and loving and, and have happiness all through their lives <sighs> happiness is very important. So, okay, thank you. Okay. But what's your name? Hayden? Well, Taylor, uh, Taylor. Taylor, Taylor. Taylor, Taylor. For Aubrey. For Aubrey. Taylor, Taylor for Aubrey. Okay, thank this you for is... Thank your question. I appreciate Can I get it. to the next one now? Am Go I allowed? Go for it, Am I allowed? Hey, Junior. <laughs> All right. Um, Anna Davidson. Anna Davidson says, um, please ask her my question. What month is she born? I want to know if we are birthday twins. And same goes for you, Anthony. So Anna Davidson wants to know when, what month, when were you born? What's your month and day? Uh, well, I, I was uh, born September 11th, 1948. Uh, uh, so, so I'm a Virgo. I know I'm a Virgo, but I don't choose to follow the astrology. You know, because I mean, it, it could, it could, you'd be like trying who's, to. Who said anything about astrology? You might be off. To, <laughs> I'm just saying, oh. for instance. Oh. If someone says, "Oh, that's a Virgo," let's look at the paper, and I have a job <sighs> interview. Let's say, let's say, for instance, I have a job interview, and I open the paper and to my astrology thing, and it says uh, something bad. You know, th then I'll go into the job interview with a bad attitude. I probably won't get the job, and not because of what the paper said. They'd be saying, "Oh, the paper was right." No, it was my attitude uh, of going to see about the job with with a crappy attitude and and, uh, and not feeling confident. So that's why I wouldn't. Okay. The real reason why I wouldn't be getting the job. And then, but, um, so anyway, thanks for your question. And my, well, it's not done. I, they asked me too, if, I, oh. if you don't mind. <laughs> All right. So then my birthday is November 23rd. And that's um, Anna Davidson. Anna Davidson. You can say hi to Anna. You didn't say hi to Anna Davidson yet. You, just, oh, you answered Anna, the question, but you didn't say hi to oh, Anna hi Davidson. Hi, Anna Davidson. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I, uh, hi, Anna Davidson. Hi, Anna Davidson. Thanks for asking. Yeah, I appreciate your your question. That was a good question. Thank you, Anna Davison. Get with it. Be positive. Anna Davison, right on. <laughs> All right, um, Azurski eighty eight. Hi Blanche, are you still thinking of receiving fan mail? I did. I did buy you and cameraman a small gift from my Hawaii trip last summer because I know you would love to travel there. Also, I want to give you a hug too. I hope that's not too smoochy. Love, Eric K. Oh, he has a present for... Yeah, Azurski 88. Oh, he went to Hawaii. Yeah. Oh, he went to Hawaii. All right, Hawaii. Yeah. It's a nice place to meditate. It's a real beautiful place. Uh-huh. Uh, and uh, he has a gift? Yeah, he's, he says he wants to send... He's going to send you a gift from his Hawaii trip. Oh, uh, thank you, Azurski 88. Azurski. Uh, Azurski 88. Thank yeah. you so much. And, and he wants to give you a hug. Oh, I would love to give you a hug. We'll give him a cyber hug right now. I'm going to give him a cyber hug, but okay, let, let, let me get into it. Get into it? <laughs> yeah, let me get into it. All right, we'll get to it. I, I take it personal. Okay, sorry. Okay, uh, and it said Eric. Eric K., yeah. Eric K., Yeah. I, I want to give you a, a, a nice hug, cyber. Yeah. Cyber hug? A cyber hug. A cyber hug. And, don't and get smoochy, though. Of course you don't get smoochy with your friends. Okay. Give me, uh, uh, um, Eric K. Yeah. This is a nice hug for you. A nice <laughs> hug for you. Okay. For, for you, uh, Eric K. Yeah. It's a side hug, and it's and it's a, like a grandmotherly love. No smoochy. That, that's true love. Yeah. It's not smoochy like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because that's to give the person the wrong the wrong impression okay. if you if okay. you hug someone like that. Yeah, yeah. So. Thank you. That's a nice hug, okay. Eric K. 
Yeah. All right. Wherever you live, I, I send I send the love to you. Okay. Not not it's like a it's, I no know smoochie. It's cyber. No smoochie. No smoochie. Of course not. Okay. Um, of course Jack, not. <laughs> Jack Sinclair. Hey Blanche, I'm Jack from Indiana. My question is, do you have a celebrity crush? If so, who is it? Also, what's your favorite restaurant to eat at? So Jack Sinclair. Jack Sinclair? From Indiana, yeah. From Indiana. Yeah. Wow, Indiana. I, I don't even hear about Indiana on the news, so it must be <laughs> must be a safe place to live. You don't yeah. even hear about Indiana. But it's, do you? I'm just saying about Indiana. Okay, I, I, okay. It's interesting to me, Calm the down. different places that, that are writing. Do you have a celebrity crush? I always like Elvis Presley. And I, uh, Elvis Presley is tough. He's a tough guy. And oh, he, yeah, he's handsome tough. and tough, and he had it going on. <laughs> he had it going on all the time. Okay. And when he said jail, Jailhouse Rock, that was really rocking out. What's your favorite restaurant to eat at? Um, well, when, when I can afford it, I go, I go to uh, Norm's. Uh, Norm's because they sell good steaks. Oh, okay. And I, like I said, I like to get my hands on a good steak sometimes. I like it medium rare. <laughs> That's when I could get to Norm's. But okay. uh, if it's a different kind of place, I, I sometimes I, I go to uh, Colonel Sanders. Oh, KFC. Uh, it's kind of like a fast food place compared KFC. to a restaurant. KFC, right? KFC, yeah. yeah. It's kind of fun to eat there with the corn and the yeah. biscuits. And the, I like that, the chicken okay. and gravy. And that's Jack Sinclair. Oh, thank you, Jack St. Sinclair. Appreciate your your um, comment, Jack Sinclair. Okay. So, um, Macy McDowell says, um, can you ask Blanche who is, who inspires her the most? Who inspires me the most? Yeah, aside from me. It's not you, cameraman. <laughs> God, man. Jeez, you must be a dreamy land. <laughs> uh, uh, the, the ones that inspire me the most is people that tried their best. That, that, that tried their best and no matter what they're doing. Uh, you know, sometimes that people are, are uh, had an operation or an accident or something, and, and I see them, 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 them you know, tr trying to walk and trying to do for themselves, no matter what age they are. I really uh, admire that. It just gives me inspiration when I see it's anyone trying for anything, no matter what it is, just keep trying their best. I love them okay. for trying their best. Okay, okay. No matter what That's it is. That's Macy McDowell. Thank you, Macy McDowell. Okay. Thank you, um, Macy. Alexandra. Appreciate your, your comment. Can I ask the next Macy? one? Macy. Can I ask? Am I allowed to talk now? Go ahead. <laughs> go, 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 okay. go ahead. Okay. Alexandra, oh, Alexandra Cruz. Ask Blanche what her opinion is on escorts and strippers. Also, what is her favorite novel? Alexandra Cruz. Well, I, I, I don't know what an escort is, uh, but uh, uh, strippers, uh, I, well, I, I think of it as uh, artistic, like <laughs> like art. I, as some of those girls, are, are, are guys probably, are, are real good at what they do. Uh, they have some good movements and it's like art to me. But it depends on who's looking. It might be someone looking at the artistic girl dancing and, and lusting after them. Uh, and, and uh, they're not looking at it in an artistic way, but I personally think it's artistic, and uh, they're very, very talented people. Have you ever done it? No. Oh, okay. Um, what's your favorite novel? Oh, I don't read novels. I, I, I read positive thinking books. They're, uh, they're always positive thinking books 90% uh, uh, of the time, but uh, sometimes I, I like to get my hands on... Uh, I go to the to the thrift store, and sometimes I get my hands on, uh, I like Archie, you know, Archie from Betty and Veronica. You like Archie and Bunker? Archie Bunker? Ar no, Archie, or Archie from Betty and Veronica. Oh, okay. I like re reading those. So yeah. Once in a while I score, and I, I get my hands on, the, on some old- uh, Old comics. Uh, uh, Archie, or Archie and Betty and Veronica. Oh, okay. I like reading them. It's like something different. It's Comic books, yeah. Something. What about it? No, I'm just saying. I'm just trying to verify. Yeah, well, you know, it looks like you rolled your eyes. Oh, okay. I can read whatever I want as long yeah, as it, 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 it's it's help me uh, relax. Is there smooching in there? Or no? There's no, no, they don't smooch. That's what I like uh, about it. They don't smooch uh. and they don't do anything uh, <laughs> dirty and filthy. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, that was um, Alexandra Cruz. 
Thank you, Alexander. Alexandra. Alexandra Cruz. Thank yeah. you, Alexandra Cruz. I appreciate your comment. Thank you for your comment. Okay, that and this is the the two lucky gunners. Can you ask Blanche if she likes to cook? Thank you. Stay positive. The two lucky gunners. Yeah. Hi, uh, two lucky gunners. It's an interesting name. Uh, do I like to cook? Uh, yeah. N not necessarily. <laughs> I, I cook because I have to. I mean, I, I, I'm not you know, Chef Mahoney uh, or stuff like that. I, I do watch TV sometimes where they're cooking something, and I, I go, wow, they, they know how to cook. You know, I, I cook just basic stuff. Mm -hmm. I, I like to learn uh, more about uh, herbs to season the food better. Because mm -hmm. right now I just use salt and pepper. I mean, basically, I the garlic when I cook a, a meatloaf or Well, something. how about you make me something to eat? I, I'm not going to make you something to eat, cameraman. No. What's wrong with well, you? Well, I have a question, though. I have a you question. You have a question to go. Yeah. What happened, what happened to your reindeer that says welcome? I'm not welcome here or what? Didn't you have a reindeer that said welcome? Yeah, yeah I know that, but... You're, I, you're not welcoming me no more or what? No, I, I, I took it I, I took it in the house because because I, I was I moved it and the little thing came off of it, so oh. I have to sew it back on again. Oh, okay. The, the little thing came So on. then I am welcome then. I, I have to in. sew it back on. So what you're saying is it's, it's not because I'm not caring. welcome. It's because I am Thank welcome. Thank you for caring. It's because I'm welcome and I can go in. No, you're not welcome. You can't come in, in here. Oh. I, I, I'm not going to cook for you. <laughs> I'm, I'm very cooked for myself. Why should I cook for you? Guy. God. How about we have a cookout? You no, cook food you, for all the yeah, YouTubers. Yeah, why don't you have a cookout? <laughs> why don't you invite the neighborhood? Oh, okay. Okay? Yeah. Okay? All right. Yeah. We'll so that, that's all the questions I got for now. Oh, okay. Thank you, you two people. I yeah. appreciate your questions, you two people. <laughs> uh, you know, uh, thank you so much for your questions. I, I enjoy, you know, just answering your questions, I feel a little better. Yeah. My throat feels better. You know okay. what? Answering questions. You know why? It took my mind off of my thoughts that, uh oh, I'm getting a little, uh uh. You know, so then answering your questions took my mind off of what I was feeling. Oh, okay. So now I feel better. All right. Okay? All right. Thank you, YouTube people, for making me feel better. God. Thank you. So loud. All right. Thank you, YouTube people. Thank you. <laughs> okay, bye. Yeah, bye. 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 <laughs>